Hey, it's Ari here. How you doing? Hopefully you're doing well. In today's video, I want to talk specifically about email follow-up and why it is so critically important when you are looking to build a long-term sustainable business online. So something that I feel a lot of people tend to really um, uh, kind of brush off, you know, when they're just getting started is, you know, having a good uh, email follow-up sequence. Or what I mean by that is, you know, a series of emails that you know, go out on your behalf, as well as, you know, emails that you, you know, write, you know, afterwards, you know, that you send out to your list of uh, subscribers that, you know, they opt into your form. And um, the reason I really want to talk about this is actually because, well, um, a lot of people, they, they think that if they drive enough traffic to a certain offer that it's just going to, you know, uh, start producing them, you know, money right then and there. It's going to start um, allowing them to profit, you know, on for each, um, you know, traffic run that they do. And unfortunately, that's just not the case. I mean, that may have worked, you know, 10 to 15 years ago when, you know, entrepreneurship and, you know, like people were just getting online and uh, they were just looking for, you know, ways of, you know, making money online because there weren't as many people doing it. Uh, but nowadays, you know, you have so much competition out there that um, it's almost impossible nowadays to just send traffic to an offer blindly and then just have it convert into sales right away. This is especially if you have, uh, if you're just using like a pre-built um, sales funnel system that, you know, maybe your um, affiliate program is providing you or like a network marketing company. So in this video, I want to talk specifically about email marketing, you know, email follow-up and why it is so critically important that you really focus on not just getting lots of traffic to your offer, uh, not just building your list, but also following up with them on a very consistent basis. So um, right off the bat, something that I highly recommend, um, re regardless of what you're promoting, you know, depending on the niche that you're in, you ideally want to be following up with your, um, with your leads, you know, uh, and, and you want to provide them lots of value in terms of what it is that they are, you know, opting in for. So for instance, if you're promoting like a, um, a health and wellness uh, product or, you know, some sort of, you know, program or solution that will help them get a better result in their life, you know, maybe they're trying to get into better shape or they're trying to lose weight or something like that. Um, what I highly recommend is that you really focus on creating a uh, email series that'll go out, you know, on, on your behalf. And with this, you could provide them additional value in terms of, you know, uh, tips on how they could, you know, lose weight easier. Um, and, you know, I recommend, you know, giving them uh, value up front for free, you know, not just, you know, trying to get them back to the offer, but actually uh, providing them uh, lots of value. So um, something that a lot of people are uh, starting to really look at is th this thing called a value series where, you know, people opt in and instead of just going straight to your uh, product that you're promoting, you can create what's called a value series. So this is where, you know, you can create like a video series or, or, of some sort. You could have it like maybe like four to seven days long. And um, it could just be, you know, videos of you sharing things that, you know, you've learned in the specific weight loss program or whatever the program is about. And you could share, you know, a bit of uh, information for free. Not Obviously not the whole thing because, you know, if someone wants to get all the pieces to the puzzle, they will have to actually buy into the uh, product that you are recommending. So what you could actually do when you've got people opting into your list, you know, and they're seeing, uh, you know, the product that you have, instead of just sending them uh, straight to the offer, what you could do is that you could provide them, you know, information for free. You could, you know, create YouTube videos, you could email them to your, um, to your list, and that this way when people, they, when you follow up with them this way and they see that, you know, you are a real genuine person and you're looking to, you know, not just try and, um, you know, earn a, earn a quick buck off of them, but, you know, when they see that you are actually providing them with lots of value in terms of, you know, things that they could learn, you know, to get a better result, uh, this is going to help uh, really build up that no like and trust factor. And the thing is, like, uh, I, say, I say this, you know, pretty much in every video almost, um, people buy from those that they know, like, and trust. So if you are, you know, really focusing on, you know, building up that credibility and you're really focusing on, you know, providing them with lots of value to show that you actually, you know, you truly care, 
they're going to be much more interested in buying whatever it is you promote over the average person who's just sending lots of traffic uh, straight to their offer. So when it comes to email follow-up, I mean, this is easily one of the most important things that you should really be focusing on when you're looking to build any sort of business for that matter. Um, you know, affiliate marketing, network marketing. Um, when you've got people opting in to your email list, these are people that, you know, they are, you know, they have struggles that they are facing. They have goals. They have ambitions, you know, and you have to be willing to actually put yourself out there to really, um, you know, give, you know, lots of value and show that you are there to truly help. And as long as you can do this on a consistent basis, you really focus on following up with them. You show that you're genuine and you provide them with lots of information that they are, you know, looking for. This is really going to help with you know, showing that you are real, you're genuine, and that you, you know, are looking to actually help these people. And when you actually, um, you know, position yourself that way, when you position yourself as, you know, you don't ha necessarily have to be like an expert in your niche, you know, you could just be someone who is currently going through whatever program it is, you know, you could be, you know, learning things. And as you're learning things, you know, as you are going along, along on your journey, you could then share you know some tips that you know you've learned along with your um, your audience that actually subscribe to you so when people they opt into your um, to your list these are people that you could pretty much you know they are pretty much in your database and you could follow up with them over and over again and the nice thing about this is that if you focus on building a really good um, you know email sequence you know where you could pretty much automate a huge part of it uh, this could really help with you know saving you lots of time where you know you could be sending lots of traffic and then when they opt in they get that uh, you know maybe the four day you know value series or seven days or however long you decide to make it and that this way they could really you know they could get uh, you could really build up that no like and trust factor and the nice thing is you know uh, you can actually just build this up once and when you build up a really powerful uh, email sequence you could pretty much automate a huge part of your business. So a, the huge benefit of, you know, building an online business versus, you know, like traditional, uh, you know, offline business or, you know, network marketing, um, you know, the benefit to this is that, you know, you could automate a huge part of it where if you could actually do this right, you know, you don't have to be there, you know, approaching people one-on-one, -on -one, um, following up with each person individually. You could automate a huge portion of this where, you know, if you build up a really powerful email sequence and you could actually have that where it pretty much follows up with your audience for you so that is by far like the most important thing you could really focus on when you're just getting started you know your email list uh, they say is your biggest asset when it comes to building a business online so this is by far the number one thing you should really focus on when you've got you know lots of traffic coming in you are getting lots of leads is that you want to be following up with these people as often as you can. The more you could do this, the more successful you will be in the long run. So anyways, hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, let me know what you thought in the comment section down below. And if you'd like to learn how you could build a profitable business online through affiliate marketing and you're looking to you know, promote something online, you wanna really learn how to become a powerful promoter, there will be a link in the description that'll give you access to a free webinar you could attend. And that will show you how you could become an independent marketer where you could pretty much market uh, whatever it is you want. This really focuses on uh, teaching you the skills and also um, setting you up to get uh, multiple streams of income where you aren't just depending on one particular system to do all the selling for you, but this is really meant to you know set you up and become independent as a marketer. So if that is something that you know resonates with you and you're like, man, I really want to learn more about this, be sure to check out that webinar in the description, uh, see what you think. Anyways, hopefully you found this video helpful. Let me know what you, what you thought in the comments. Share this with anyone whom you feel could benefit and take care.